choose. For my next video, I'm going to be doing Amy's organic beans, corn, tomatoes, cheese enchiladas. I've had these before. They're actually pretty good. Um, I'm not a big health food, organic, got to have all that kind of stuff, but you know, if they're good, I'll eat them. This is a uh, your typical, most like most Amy's meals, make a one inch slit in the over wrap. I just rip the end, cook for four and a half minutes, remove over wrap, stir beans, and cook for an additional minute and a half. A lot of times I just skip that and I just go for the straight, cook it for four minutes. And don't worry about stirring the beans or anything. That's probably what I will do today, actually. So let's see what we got in here. Uh, that ripped open as usual. One of these days, somebody's going to invent one that works right. Oh, wow. Huh, how'd I get in there? Mm, appetizing, as usual. Ooh, ice crystals. I need to eat these. I need to eat these meals a little faster. All right. One inch slid on the end. And we will... I'm just going to go for the straight four minutes and not worry about any of the other stuff here. Uh, there's the ingredients list if you want to pause and read that. And the nutritional facts. One serving is one tray. 360 calories. Like 16 grams of fat. 35 milligrams of cholesterol, 770 on sodium. Not too bad for a meal this size. Let's see, anything else on here that looks interesting? Gluten free. Well, oh, oh, sh Well, that was a disaster. Let's see, anything on the end here that we need to know about? I'm gonna pause, you can read that. But, got about two and a half minutes. We'll be back then. Well, we're back, it's been done. I did it for four minutes. I didn't do the stirring or any of that. I stirred it when it came out. Um, not to always continually overstate the obvious, but they don't look alike. They don't look like much at all. Um, and the other thing is, if you really, really wanted to be a stickler for the details, the beans in the corner flipped from what the picture shows, but you know, who cares? I tell you what, the cheese in these things is really good. And they usually come out lava hot too. Uh, that should be good. But let's try the beans first. We'll go from what's probably the least hot to the hottest. Beans, eh, they're okay. Oops. <laughs> Corn. Not bad. Pretty good, actually. Not award winning or anything. Let's get this up here. We got corn, cheese, all kinds of stuff in that, in that one. I keep getting way off here on my picture here. Letting this cool down a minute. <laughs> I know it's screaming hot. Oh, this is going to be hot. Mm-hmm. Mm. Man, there was a lot more cheese in that than I thought. That was chewy. 
flailing my hands around over here in the dock, thinks I'm signaling her. Get out of here, dog. My dog usually doesn't stand under my feet while I cook, but for some reason, when there's a camera involved, she thinks that uh, it's her time to become a star or something. I don't know. Mm. Beans and corn, I'm not too thrilled about. They're average. This is not bad, though. This is pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to let this cool down a bit, but if you've ever tried the Amy's chili, well, chili, cheese enchilada. So they're looking at the beans and thinking chili. If you've ever tried Amy's cheese enchilada, you liked it? Let me know in the comments. If you didn't like it, let me know in the comments. Let me know what you thought about this meal.